Chimaroke Namani of uh, PDP is begging the youth not to support uh, Peter B because they not believe that uh, all the youth, majority of the youth are supporting Obi and he's begging them don't support Peter B, support uh, Tinumbu. It's in PDP, oh. Well, I think uh, that is the rave of the moment now. So he's begging the youth to support uh, Tinumbu, not uh, Peter B. And they will not tell you, oh, I think it was Gumi that said this, that the majority of the people who are just supporting Peter B are just youth. They are youth that uh, shouldn't even concentrate only on youth. You should concentrate on everybody. And when you check the population of the country, majority of them are, are youth. They are youth. So what are they talking about? And these same people will come out and tell you that uh, politics is all about the numbers. It's all about numbers. People's Democratic Party PDP Senator Chima Roke Nnamani has adduced Reasons Nigerian youth should see the All Progressives Congress APC presidential candidate Bola Tinubu as the preferred option in the 2023 election. You, you could see that something is really wrong somewhere. For this man to be doing this anti party, oh, something is really wrong somewhere. Mr. Namani said that Mr. Tinubu, on assumption of office as governor of Lagos State in 1999, embarked on a series of sustainable policies towards addressing the high unemployment rates and youth issues i don't think there should be any problem if he has done well i think people should be aware of aware of that now uh -uh. just like uh, some of them are saying that uh, oh he helped them he did this he did that he helped them so and they are the ones now trying to root for him campaigning for him so if he has done well for the youth do you should be able to understand you that you are from a uh, uh, enugu how did you know that he did for them in Lagos? He said he built a only come with how many millions and all of that. I think the people should be able to do that. He can't tell me that they are not aware. If they are aware of what you are talking about. And people are asking this in Namani. He was a governor too. So what did you do for your own people? What did you do for your own people? So if Tinubu has done well, you don't need a to say Like I've always said, everybody in as much you are you are eligible to vote. At, at 18, you take your decision. Not to talk of a majority of the people who are still voting that you know within 25 maybe 20 that 18 to 20 but if you check the population the large numbers of people who are voting that should be between 25 and 40 so they are not babies so they should know whether it is true or not you are coming from a enugu telling them to do this or do that well mr anaman is setting umbu on assumption of office that he embarked on series of sustainable policies towards addressing the high unemployment rates and youth issues according to the senator who is former governor of enugu state in a series of tweets okay hashtag city underscore boy series noted that lagos state at the period saw a significant influx of youth looking for better livelihood but why is it that the has taking over now he claimed that mr tinubu initiated waves of changes that revived revived the economy because he understood that it would have been terrible if left untreated he claimed that the apc candidates made sure that the vast majority of workers who were mainly young people had jobs he said that mr tinubu also founded the anti-drug misuse campaign initiative to educate teenagers about the dangers of using illegal drugs pointing out that the epidemic of widespread drug abuse had successfully destroyed many young people. According to Mr. Namani, Mr. Tinubu's administration in Lagos State gave grants totaling more than 1 million naira to each of the registered voluntary youth organizations as thanks for their assistance with reorientation efforts and, for motivate, and to motivate them to be more effective. In addition, he added, Tinubu increased the annual financing for the rehabilitation organizations to about three million naira and subsequently established youth centers to engage in educational and recreational activities he claimed that sinobu administration renovated recreation centers that had been abandoned for years spending 14 million naira and 4 million naira respectively on the onikon youth center on lagos island and the akimomi youth center in ikeja Mr. Inamani, who represents Enugu East Senatorial District, noted that while the long forgotten Igbogbo open space in Ikorodu was fully restored, the Akowonjo open space only received a total investment of 7 million. 
So this is what they have written for you because you were there southeast. I don't know if you know all these ones. Have you been able to give account of what you did in your own time? Thank God you were once a governor as well. He claimed that in order to help hoodlums, neighboring kids, and the homeless who wanted to turn their lives around, Tinubu's administration created vocational or vocational training centers in March 2003. He claimed that Mr. Tinubu accomplished this by giving them economic empowerment through instruction in trades like carpentry, shoemaking, air styling, and tie and dye. So, what's the other one got to consign somebody with the Kugina? I don't cut a concern. Uh, this thing when they talk, uh, they, they do it for their own states now. They are governors in all those various states. They did all those ones, they will tell you say they don't do all these things. So what they call consign person with the data now. Say make uh, because you do that one for you book book and you do this one for that. So they should do what honestly <laughs> he gets us to be what this uh, man they talk. He is a man with Z to help the youth in realizing their dreams, distinguished senator. You said it so. Hmm. Are you aware that uh, you have no moral rights to campaign for Tinubu just looking for crumbs? Tell your children to back Tinubu, not Nigerian youth. Chibo is now PDAPC. He is not even talking about his own election, but Tinubu is partner in business. But the Almighty God will decide it. Blind cannot see Tinubu eaters will not consider that. No, you don't believe in, if you don't believe in other people, you don't expect people to believe. <laughs> Whatever I want to say, there's this record of this man out there. So forget all those uh, haters. No, the haters, the person that you are even talking about now is part of the this government that Nigerians are suffering. If not for anything, Mr. Man, keep your opinions to yourself, anti-party person. Look at them, enemies of our land. Sinking betrayer. My brother, thank you for justifying your own share from the bullion van. But try not to pull out others with it just enjoy it alone don't even bring it to your family please i can only see a very big for nothing old man you mean the area boys employment yes we the youth should back tinubu that is a chimaroki for you this man we with his gang is giving us a reason why we should back one of their head member hand member please somebody should ask that man a simple question since his venture into government or into politics what has been is has been this man's contribution to the human race or to the nigerian cause yes we should back tinubu how can this man in all sincerity open that his mouth to demand this from the nigerian youth yes we back tinubu he looks at nigerians with vibrant and smart educated youth all over the world and he picked Tinubu so that he and his cohorts will continue to squander our collective common wealth. Hmm. Now can you imagine? Hmm. Let them continue. Common wealth. Let them continue. His opinion is they will tell you entitled to his opinion.